before we go any further make sure you like comment share and subscribe if this is the first time watching my youtube videos make sure you subscribe so guys in today's video i'll be showing you my <coughs> excuse me i'll be showing you my you know my monthly budget so the thing is me i don't have a fixed salary yeah that's because uh you know that's because your girl is just doing business so i don't have a fixed salary so it just depends with how much we've worked for uh in that particular month so for this uh for the january budget that i'm giving you guys um uh, I'll, I'll 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 just write down the things that I'm supposed to do, like the ones that I know that these are, yes, I'm supposed to do, these I'm supposed to do, yes. Then at the end of uh, like the things that I'll write down, then I'll tell you the ones that I've managed to, you know, to pay or maybe to buy, just like that. But I don't have a fixed salary. Sometimes if there's no business, what I usually do is, um, I first begin with the most important things. What, what do I mean by the most important thing? The things that I'm supposed to do first, like the, you know, the things that I cannot uh, live without, okay? So for example, maybe paying for my house rentals because if I don't pay that piece, I'll be chased from this house. So those are the, uh, you know, the, small, the most important things that I am talking about. And then there's also like paying for electricity. Yeah, so. Don't mind my, my handwriting is bad. So just focus on what I'm about to share with you and not my handwriting. Hello. <laughs> so you guys just focus on that, okay? And not my handwriting. Is it clear? Is it clear? Is it clear, you guys? <laughs> so, okay, let's just go into, you know, I try like to write down why the things that are most important then you know we see yeah you know yeah okay let's go mm -hmm. this is my my january budget okay so the most important things that i do is first pay my rental so <coughs> so i normally uh pay f uh like uh two rentals first is the house uh rental the house rentals the one that i'm staying is that is i pay uh, 700 okay 700 then then I also pay for I pay for for the shop the shop that the those are what shop rentals shop rentals I pay 1100 kwacha per month then i also uh pay for what for for electricity for both uh shop and house uh that's mix uh how much like the okay electricity so electricity for both uh, for both that is uh for shop and uh, my house i pay um, for the for the house it's uh 75 then the shop i pay two 200 so that's two 275 
yeah to 75 then i also saw for water water that's for both so both the the house and the shop for the for the house it depends with uh, how much the bill is but mostly uh like the other time we had uh the we had a, a linkage the bill went up to skisti kwacha but for this month i was told we we'll pay 40 kwacha then for the shop mostly it doesn't go beyond 20 kwacha so i'll say uh for for the whole house and the shop it's about 60 kwacha okay how i wish i can you know put this in um in in dollars but then dollars okay i'll try at the end i'll try like to put you know how much how much because i don't know uh like how much dollar is now so at the end i'll try you know like to check how much is the um how much are we buying and selling the dollar so that i find i should also put the you know the price uh, the dollar price here somewhere here okay so i pay for the house i pay for the shop uh, electricity both for the house and the shop then what about the house and electricity okay so i i also help my grandma i also help my grandma mostly okay like the way i've told you it depends with um with how business is so if that other month i like we had a uh, business like if we had enough for we've made enough for that month then i just get a 1000 buy for the things for her, buy the, the house groceries for her but then if i i don't have that much um sometimes i just give her a 500 or 400 and then she tops up with whatever she has so it depends like for this month i'm not really sure how much i'm going to give her because the business has, hasn't been well uh, all that good so i might say i just put a 500 here okay a 500 so i also need to buy the my groceries you know for the groceries like for my house if i'm buying like uh the relish and the relish and uh these other groceries like the the soap the what the what mostly i use like um like 800 somewhere there but i don't i don't buy these things like at once so for example I'll give you an example like what i did this month on the i think it was on the 15th of uh, january yeah i think you 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 saw the video that i posted that i went to buy some you know some relish dio dio you know so because um last month last month that was december i didn't balance up so well so uh i happened to get some some relish on the 15th of this month so that day i spent about uh you know i spent about uh five five to five something like that five to six hundred i think so five something like that and then once i i got the money i also uh got like um a 200 200 something then i went to buy some uh washing soap and um, my bathing soap and you know so that's it and then apart from that i also um buy my lunch but not every day i wouldn't say like every day every day but not sure i buy my lunch i buy my breakfast at the shop sometimes if i don't cook you you see sometimes i prepare my lunch but sometimes i don't so for my for my lunch um, at the shop i i can just say i use about uh, you know 300 if i say 10 kwacha per day 
yeah so i'll say about 300 then uh there are times when i you know use the transport but not on a daily basis so on the transport i'll say transport because most i use a uh, um a what a bicycle that is five kwacha so i'll just say like for transport i use how much for 30 days that's like 150 okay 150 but it's not every day that's why i've written uh 150 because it, if it was going to be uh like every day for 30 days that means going and coming that's like 10 quarts and then it will be about 300 so because i i don't use the, the like the transport every day so that's why i've written uh, uh the 150 yeah so apart from this uh, i save so saving i wouldn't say i save a specific like uh amount no uh i just save with uh whatever i don't know mm, it's just some coins so i would say maybe in a month um i save about oh or maybe five quarter five quarter or ten ten quarter i think so like in a month mm. i would say ten quarter these are the coins yeah like the video that i did you guys you saw like the last year's money the coins that i saved there were about three thousand something yeah so it's not like every day but it's just some loose 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 are coins that we normally have in our handbags ladies those are the coins that i save okay then there's also this woman who helps me with uh you know washing my clothes you know washing my clothes isn't i just don't like you know i just don't like 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 washing my clothes it's not that i don't know how to wash i know but i just don't like okay so this woman i i pay her 200 200 per month okay sometimes it's less than this it depends with uh, the clothes for that month okay and moreover i'm a grown-up girl i i i don't uh you know mess up my clothes like that much so it just depends okay i'll pay uh the ones that I work with at the salon. Okay, I would say salaries. Yeah, here. So this is we're talking about uh, one thousand. Okay, one thousand, one thousand. So I think these are the most things, most important things that you know. Uh, I can say I spend my money on. So the let me now tell you the things that I've like managed so far for this month. I've money I've only managed to pay for 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 the house, yes. The shop no. Then for electricity for both I haven't yet paid. Then the water bill I haven't yet paid. I haven't given my grandmother the money, no. For the groceries just like i told you so it would depends maybe next month uh by maybe the 10th of um, uh, next month february that's when i'll get my groceries i don't know when but then this one i'm sp i'm spending this one i don't pay just there and then but then i'm using this one i use it like on a daily basis same a price with uh, my transport like i use this money every day so like when coming i i you know it was raining then uh, i just wanted to get home on time so that you know i can um uh bath and then warm myself so i i use transport when coming that's about five quarter only so this transport also i can say i'm using this one so this one yes this one yes i only 
managed to pay for the house then the woman and then this one for saving like for this month i haven't saved anything yet that's because things haven't been you know it's not only here, like i uh, i don't know how i can explain but i haven't been i haven't saved anything yet for this month like january yeah then this woman i think i sought her out that week when i got back from uh, lusaka yeah i sought this woman out and then the story is yes this is what i was doing last uh last weekend uh not, not really last weekend but on the weekend i would say because <laughs> today is on the what so on the 20 today is on the 29th so 29th so i was giving them these monies on the on the 28 27 on the 25th 27th of january so i gave out this for the for them i gave out this for the for the salaries and then the, the woman who washed for me and then i haven't saved and then for transport yes uh, lunch yes and then grandmother no water for both uh electricity and what no and then for the sh for shop rentals no and then the house rentals yes this one so i've only managed to pay for these three one uh two three these are the big things that i've managed to do so far so let me just put the you know the dollars the dollars now <laughs> this side so that you at least you have an idea like like i don't know how the cost of living in zambia like if you're staying alone okay so so guys these are the 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 dollars that i found because uh like uh the one u.s dollar uh is equal to like 19 point point uh kwacha zambian kwacha so i've just i've just said when doing my calculations i just did one one u.s dollar is equal to 20 kwacha that's zambia malawi so when you do that when do you do the calculations you see that the 700 is equal to 35 us dollar then 1100 is equal to 55 us dollar and then the 75 is equal to uh 13 kwacha us dollar oh, 13 13 us dollar then the skist is equal to three dollars then the 500 is equal to 25 us dollars and then the 800 is equal to 40 us dollars then the 300 again is equal to 15 us dollar 150 is equal to 7 us dollar then uh 10 quarter is less than a dollar less than a dollar somewhere there and then 200 that's like 10 us dollar then 1000 that's like 50 us dollar so this is what i i thought i should share with you guys so this is what my budget normally looks like okay so and those are the things that i managed to do and the things that i didn't manage to do if there's anything that you feel you're not clear about you can you know comment down so that i, I tell you um but otherwise my budget is simple and straightforward so this is the these are the things that i do okay so thank you so very much you guys for always coming back to watch my videos if this is the first time watching my video make sure you uh, like comment share and subscribe and don't forget to turn on the notification bell so that whenever i post you guys get to to be notified okay so for me it's bye see you in my next video guys